Right, a, a beautiful good morning to you viewers. Uh, I'm here with uh, Jeremy here and uh, we are about to do the incline. So this is what happened. So I'm just showing you the big view of the track so that you can see where the incline is coming from. Guys, don't forget to subscribe on our channel and share the videos with other people. I hope you are doing well. And, um, and also don't forget to tell us where you're watching, right? Uh, Jeremy, we need to do incline, right? Put gear number one, balance your car. Balance your car. I'm not yet, re not yet ready. Balance your car. Balance your car. Right, one, two, three, four, five. Then put in brake down nicely. Right, stop. And brake up again, neutral. Put gear number one, balance your car. Balance your car. All right, one, two, three, four, five. And break down nicely. Right, stop. And break up gear neutral. Gear number one, balance your car. Heavy balance for me. Heavy balance. I don't hear the heavy balance. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. And break down nicely. Stop. And break up. Gear neutral. Gear number one. Balance your car. Full observation. And break down nicely. Stop. And break up. Right. So do you see that gap of the car going backwards? It has to be there. You understand? Because if the car does, if the car doesn't go uh, go backwards, right? By the time you want to move forward, it will start going backwards and then go forward. You understand? You did very good. When you stop, you release the brakes after handbrake, right? Let's go again. Balance your car. Hear the vibration. I need to hear the sound. I can't hear it. Uh, yes, you hear the sound there. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Handbrake down. Right. Stop. And break up again, you throw. Yeah. Okay. When this thing happen, what is your plan? Show me what you're gonna do. The first thing you're gonna do there when your car, you switch off the car. Are you sure? Yeah, my is up. Okay. Put the end brake down. End brake down. Ah. You are not pressing anything, right? Okay. The car is standing still, right? Did you see? It's still in gear, right? That's the reason why the car is standing still, isn't it? Okay, so now I ask you again. What is the first thing that you're going to do? Gonna pull the up. Okay. You know almost this story, ne? Put the handbrake down. Okay. Right, press the clutch inside. Leave the clutch. Do you see what happened? Other people do that during the exam, right? When you make a mistake and your track is switched off the same way the your one do, it's very true. It's handbrake up first before you do anything. You understand? Because if you press clash now, press clash again. Press clash. You see what happened? The car is going to go what? Backwards. Get backwards, right? So this is what I'm telling you now to know. When your track is switched off during the time for the test, that is not a problem. Hear me again. That is not a problem. That is not a problem. That is not a problem. What is the problem is to press clash because you are replacing brakes with what? With a clash. That's why you must put handbrake up nicely and handbrake up nicely, gear neutral, right? Can you do handbrake up nicely with it? Right, gear neutral. Why didn't the car go backwards? Because the handbrake is up, right? Do you understand this thing? No matter how much you're going to rush, rush on your test, be very careful with these things that I'm telling you. You might have anxiety or something come up. And then when you start rushing, rushing on the incline, you make mistake, you press the clutch and the car, go what? Go backwards. You understand? We want to do it again. That is switching off the car. We want to do it again. Start your car again so that we have the good enough experience. Year number one. Balance your car. Balance your car. Full observation. 
I want you to leave handbrake and leave the clutch same time. Né? Do that now. Right, you see that? The car is still same place. You understand? The car is same place. The other thing that you are learning is you must never leave the clutch one time. I told you to leave one time now né? because I want you to get this experience. When you are doing this incline, we do what we do, we, we, we call clash control. You understand? How is controlling the clash? When something is balanced, that means your leg is not moving. It's remaining on one what? One position. Until you are very sure that your vehicle is what? Is moving. That is when you are going to leave the what? The clash. You understand? Now you put, uh, if you press clash in, inside mistakenly, what happens? Press the clash. You see there, the car will go backwards, you understand? I'm telling you this because most of the people, even the drivers, they can even know how to drive. But when it comes to that, uh, uh, what you call, issue, they panic. When you panic, the second thing comes in your, in your mind, maybe it's to press brakes and what? And clash. The moment you press the clash, then the car is going backwards. You understand? All right. So, this is what I'm telling you, that you need to, 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 to understand, yeah? Handbrake up first is your priority. Put handbrake and then gear neutral. All right. After this gear neutral, what's next? You're going to start your car now. That means your car is out of danger. You understand? Start your car. Right. Now we are doing now normal incline. We were doing the bed side of the of the incline but now we are doing the the incline the original one let's go maybe some other people uh, traffic department they want you to do mirror mirror blind spot indicate to the right now uh, they want you to do uh, they want you to do uh half observation to the right you understand do it now then you indicate this is some traffic department uh-huh then gear number one balance your car nicely feel the heaviness one two three four five and break down nicely you see then leave the clash later you stop again stop one time you stop once and break up gear neutral gear number one balance your car this is wrong this is wrong This is wrong. This is wrong. All right. Make sure you put your handbrake nicely. Do you see what happened there? That is wrong. Né? Let's fix it. Gear number one. Balance your car. After balancing your car, you're going to do full observation for me. One, two, three, four, five. Handbrake down nicely. Right. Leave the clutch. You can stop again there. Stop. Right. Handbrake up nicely. Leave everything. Right. Gear number one. Well done on this one. Gear number one. Balance your car. Balance your car. Feel the balance. I need to hear the sound. Yeah. Those sound. One, two, three, four, five. Then break down nicely. Alright. Stop again. And break up. Gear neutral. Gear number one. Balance your car. Balance your car. Feel heavy. Balance. Balance more, balance more, balance more, balance more. One, two, three, four, five. And break down nicely. Right, stop there. Right, and break up gear neutral. Okay, well done. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. You see, this is how we do incline. Don't forget, guys, to subscribe on our channel and tell us where you're watching this video. So make sure you are understanding what is incline. When you are doing your things in a rashness, you're never going to have the what? Tell me. You're never going to have a good result. Because sometimes the rushing is unnecessary. You understand? So that's what I'm saying. Make sure you do the right things. Every time you, when you go to the incline, even during your test, do not rush during that incline and break up nicely it's better to celebrate when you have the license 
you cannot celebrate without what the license thank you guys i hope you are going to enjoy it. don't forget to subscribe on the channel and share the videos with other people see you soon thank you stay tuned god bless you